Welcome everybody, it's Tom, and today we're going to be talking about the trophies inside Thrice of Drake that were released because of the giant patch we got, and we're going to be discussing all of them inside this video. But before we get into it, I want to mention, I made a video on the minigun because we already have gameplay of it and all that good stuff on my channel. You can go check it out, it'll be in the description, of course you can go to my channel, it's my second to newest video, and I should have an annotation at the end of this video. So without further delay, let's get into it. So the first trophy we actually see is called Death From Above. In Dryzid Draka, kill every kill a zombie while use, being flung through the Wonder Sphere. So I'm pretty sure the Wonder Sphere is the bounce pad we see inside the trailer and killing a zombie while you're actually being flung through it seems like a difficult task indeed. So good luck doing that whoever's going to try for that. Fling me to the moon. In the Rise of Drake, use every Wonder Sphere twice. So again, the Wonder Sphere is probably the thing that are going to be flinging you and just using them twice pretty much a face value thing and nothing to really talk about except the name because the name when I first saw Fling Me to the Moon I got so happy when I saw it but then I read it and I was kind of disappointed because Fling Me to the Moon? Why'd you say moon there? You're just teasing me then. So I, I just got a little annoyed with it. Then we get That's a Lot of Jigawatts. In the Rise of the Rocket Electric U 121 Zombies. So when I first saw this one I started laughing because what the heck? 121 zombies? What kind of number is that? Who, who who, in their right mind said, Wait, wait, I got an idea for this trophy. All you have to do is electrocute 121 zombies. No, you can't, it can't be 120. It has to be 121. So, I did just... What's up with that number? I bet you I'm going to be trying to get this. I'm going to be one zombie off on the, on the game I play to get it. But, of course... Let's actually talk about what it can actually be. If you're going to be electric shooting zombies, um, you're probably going to use traps, I'm guessing. I'm not too sure. Of course, it could be something else completely, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be traps and stuff like that. I'm not too sure. There could be a perk coming out or a gobble gum that can electrocute too. Quick off your feet. In the Rise of the Rocket, a wall by the BMR. So, the BMR is an LMG, if you guys did not know, and... Wall buying LMG has only been in one other map, I believe, and it was buried. And of course, I'm pretty sure it's the same thing because it's called Quick Off Your Feet, so you're going to have a very limited time to buy this BMR, just like in Buried, because the L set was on top of this platform that collapsed, so you had to be really quick buying it and it cost 2000 So I'm pretty sure it's going to be something similar to that. Time to Slam in Dreyse the Dark Rocket, revive two players protected by the Ragnarok DG4. So. This DG4 of course sounds like something Rick Toffin made because Wonder Waffle, when you upgrade it became the Wonder Waffle DG4, so I'm not too sure what it can mean. It sounds like an upgrade version of it, but revive two players being protected by the Ragnarok DG4. It it sounds like a wonder weapon, but how are they being protected if it's a weapon weapon? I'm I'm just not sure what the heck that means. And I'll show you guys the next one, which makes me question it even more. Not big enough. In the Rise of the Rocket trap and kill a panzer soldat using the Ragnarok DG4. So I guess it's like this cage type of deal thing, I'm not sure, I, I just, I'm just not sure at all. Of course if you guys have any ideas, tell me down in the comments. Next we get none left standing, in the rise of the rocket kill every type of zombie using a minigun and when it says minigun I'm pretty sure it means the death machine that we already have video of and of course down in the description if you guys are going to want to go watch that gameplay. Kill every type of zombie using the minigun, so I'm guessing they're saying that there's multiple types of zombies, which I'm not too sure what they mean by, because from the trailers, we haven't seen multiple different types of zombies, so of course, go ahead and tell me what you guys think down in the comments, but I'm, again, stumped at this one. Take a bow. In the Rise of Drake, upgrade the Wrath of the Ancients, so I want to actually come back to this one, because the one we get after is the giant word in the rise of the rocket obtain all the ancient bows so i'm pretty sure these two things are the same thing except uh, in the take a bow is going to be the upgraded version of the ancient of the ancient bows so i'm not too sure if last but not least we get this hidden trophy so i'm pretty sure this is going to be the main easter egg but of course people figured out what it was and if you look very carefully you can actually see this Yep, my brother's keeper in the Rise of the Rocket, the one must be a race. So I have no idea right now what this can mean because what does it mean by be a race? Are they trying to 
destroy somebody, kill somebody, maybe the Maxis or Richtofen from this universe, because I'm because a nice theory is that these events are happening at the same time as the Moon events. So maybe you're trying to kill Richtofen or Maxis. I'm not sure. Of course, tell me what you guys think down in the comments. My brother's keepers look so cool. I'm not too sure. Tell me again. Tell me what you guys think. And don't forget to like and subscribe because this video was sick. And if you guys want to see some Dries and Draki gameplay, they'll be on later tonight. Of course, the DLC is going to be released at 12 p.m. 12 a.m. Pacific. So I'll have gameplay as soon as I can. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys on my next video.